Good afternoon, good evening, good morning. I'm not sure what it is where you are right now, but it's afternoon here, beautiful snowy May afternoon in Denver. I want to talk to you about a great product that I ran into at a Honor Roadshow recently and share with you a little bit of the couple of different things that this company offers. Before I do, if you haven't heard or listened to or played at Honor um, Marine Band Deluxe recently, you gotta grab one of these. I know, add it to your list of harps to get. You gotta get a rocket, you gotta get this, you gotta get that, but you know what? Before you know it, you won't need anything else because you'll have everything perfectly where you want it. So you get the idea. I'm I'm showing you some of the also the flexibility as a non-overblow player. The overblow pops out effortless effortlessly without having to adjust uh, any gapping on the reeds, which is rare on an out of the box harp. Crossovers you can find as well. It just depends. Um, I'm loving this as a marine band, a fan of the marine band harmonica, the tone of that instrument, and the playability. They've just made it even better with these screws on the cover plates, the three and the reed plates inside there, heavier gauge, and then the triple lacquered pair wood, super smooth. That is a huge thing for me as a tongue block player. I want that. Okay, so that's the Marine Band Deluxe. I just wanted to share that. Cadillac Pete. I ran into this guy in Florida a couple weeks back at a road show, on a road show, and he says, I want to show you this thing. And he pulls out basically this tray, this system, this harmonica stand from a briefcase. Not the microphone, just the, the tray. And then he shows me what, how it fit in and all that, and, I'm, and it just clicked, you know. Let me just show you what the, the stand that, that Cadillac Pete has created is sitting on. Just this simple little piece, but heavy gauge metal pegs and a really super high density piece of plastic that it feels like a... It feels like a countertop is what it feels like, like a super unbreakable whatever. It's solid. On the bottom you got the choice for both US or European threading. So you just screw it right on and bam! The tray just sets right on these pegs. It's got two holes. That's it. You're done. Now you're organized. You have everything in front of you. Goes back in the same place. Keep in mind, these are designed to fit on it with a slight lean to angle and favor the person grabbing their instruments. So when you pick it up, these are open right here in the back. You want to make sure you hold it on a slight lean. You don't want to accidentally tilt it forward too much and have your harp spill out. That's all you got to get used to. Let me show you what else. Besides this plastic version, super affordable too. And that was the other thing that caught my attention. When he told me how much he paid for it, I was like, oh. This is a no-brainer. This is an ashwood version. This one you can't see through um, these little holes where the pegs are, but if you just put, see how I put my finger there and I just guided it and it went right on. Okay. Check that out. We got space for chromatics. Same setup as the plastic one. All your keys up there. Right? It's a 12 one. The keys has got to be a 12 key slot, right? Yep. So you got 12 slots in there, plus the two, what he calls like the shotgun, in case you're going to throw in third and first position or something. You have these two harps waiting, ready to go. Again, you could put more diatonics or chromatics. Could fit right there. Even if you got one of these big daddies. You know? You know? All right, so I love it because I'm sitting in an office chair and I can get it so low that I can still reach everything. Raise it up a little bit. Not only did Cadillac Pete create the trays, the system, with the locking system and the pegs that go on, but he has created a bullet mic holder that is about the simplest thing you could ever imagine, but built super solid. The construction is really solid. 
plastic screw that threads through to lock it onto the stand. Just as just like a guitar with the rubber sort of rubber plastic material. And if you can't uh, figure this out, then you need to change up whether you're eating for breakfast or something. So you raise it, give it a little bit of room. It's actually, so there's going to be a mic there. Give it a, a pinch more, right? And I'll show you once it's locked on, which takes no time at all. The bullet just rests right there. I should have done this ahead of time, but just to show you how the cable lies. But this is a really thin mic. It's thinner than an A-static. This thing still fits. So if it's even wider, it's not going to be a problem. Doesn't get too much thinner than that either. So it works perfectly so you're not, no longer throwing your mic on the floor when you want to get to the vocal mic. Or unplugging it so it doesn't feed back. Or stepping on it by accident because you put it on top of your amp or somebody's whatever. It's, and, it's, and you always know where it is. For me, that's big. I'm doing this half the time on stage. So... Bravo to Cadillac Pete. If you want to purchase these items, they're for sale at Harmonica123 via the video description. There's a link that you can check out. Um, full descriptions and pricing on these items. The case, I didn't show you the case. You would have this case, a simple, whoops, a simple briefcase. Let me put the tray in it, that would make sense. So you put the tray in again, remember, just the angle, it doesn't take long to get used to. Once you put, and I do put more than this in here, once you put a few other small cases, a couple bullet mics and your odds and ends, the cords in these two pockets up top, when you close it, it holds everything together so everything's not moving around. The harmonicas don't come out of the slots. It's nice, simple. Like, a, you know, aluminum, I guess, I don't know what's made out of. Simple briefcase, but it, it's a locking briefcase. And you can buy these systems with or without the briefcase. You can buy them on their own, or you can get them with the briefcase. So check it out. Again, what a great idea with this simple little system right here. Because not to bash all the harmonica makers that are making cases, those are a great idea to have a harmonica case that fits on the mic stand as well. I like this a lot better. I've tried the other way because this seems more stable to me. And when I got a heavier case full of harps and the whole case is doing this, sometimes if I knock into it, the tray, um, of course you can knock into anything and spill it, but like it just feels like it's on there better. And I have a system then with this little tray that I can move around. So I'm, I'm digging it. I hope you guys will um, check that out. I hope everyone's doing well. If you live in Florida, if you live in Panama City, Ocala, or Jacksonville, I will be in the, those cities on the following days, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, in that order. I'll put a link to the Honor Roadshow schedule in the video description. I hope to see you soon. Um, if not in Florida, maybe in Texas, which will be the week after. All right. Have a great one. Thanks for checking it out.